Hey, it's John, your Gen X grandpa, and today I'm reviewing the Peaky Electric Screwdriver. This is a nifty little device that was sent to me, so thank you to Peaky for sending this to me to review. It's, uh, it's USB powered, it charges off of USB, and um, yeah, it's a great little product. I've been using it, and we'll do a quick unboxing here. I say I've been using it, this is like a fake unboxing, so. Uh, <laughs> you get a very short charging cable, but you know, we've got USB-C charging cables all over the place. You get a, an adapter for smaller bits, and this is a magnetizer so that you can magnetize your bits. Inside the box is the screwdriver and the case that it comes in. There are a number of different sized bits. You can see them there. And it's really, I mean, I'm really surprised by this, to be honest with you. So you get some basic instructions here on how to operate the device. And this is the unit itself. I have to tell you what I really, really like about this case is that the case is magnetic. It's got little magnets on it. There's no clips that you have to worry about breaking, which often happens on these. And the bits are easily accessible and easily arranged. You know, you've got two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16. So you got 32 bits total plus the screwdriver itself. The screwdriver comes with a small flashlight, which you can see right there. And you can screw things in and screw things out. Got a little video there showing you how I'm using it. And there's a knob down here that allows you to adjust the speed. So you can hear that slower. And now it's completely off. So you turn it on and it's high speed. And then as you dial it back, you can hear the speed turned down. So like I said, I have used this. Uh, I used it to replace a doorknob on a door and it worked fairly well. The one complaint that I would have is these bits are a little short, it's a little hard to get this around the doorknob due to the bulk of it. If it had a longer, shaft that would be a lot easier to manage that's where you charge the screwdriver i'm kind of all over the place and then you have an indicator light uh, down here on the bottom that indicates when the device is charging so one of the really nice features about this i like this little flashlight thing here um, on the device because in a pinch, this will work as a flashlight. Not necessarily something that you would want to rely on as a flashlight, but it'll work in a pinch. And as I mentioned, the bits go in and out of the device fairly easily. They snap right in, it's all magnetic. You don't have to worry about setting it or anything like that. I can shake it and you can see that it's not coming out. Uh, I even used this on some of the screws and that were really hard to get out and I didn't ruin the tip. So that's good. This is very hard metal. That's always important. And then these snap right back in. And you put your screwdriver back in there and it closes right up. Really like that. As you can see there. I'm holding that and it's not even falling out. I'm not sure if that'll work with the screwdriver side. Oh, it does. So I'm holding just the edge of it. Even if I shake it a bit, the magnets are strong enough to hold this together. So this is a really good case. I, I really like the fact that they did not skimp on the case for this device. And so I think this is a great little gift if you're I mean, it's a few weeks until Christmas, and if you're looking for something for somebody, whoa, <laughs> that doesn't snap in. So 
It's important to remember. If you're looking for a small tool, this is great for doing work on small devices. Because you can adjust the speed, you're not having to worry about over torquing things. And honestly, the torque on this is uh, pretty low. I haven't had to charge this thing yet, and I've been kind of playing around with it and doing this quite a bit here. And like I said, I did use it on for changing a doorknob, so the battery hasn't died yet. And I really am pleased with this. So that's the P-Key electric screwdriver. I think you're going to like this. It gets the Gen X Grandpa seal of approval. I'll talk to you next time. Bye.